could ever need me was the son of a pizza man. Welcome to Son of a Pizza Man. Today we're doing an unboxing. So in front of me I have this Mickey Mouse party game. Um, there's actually, so I got this off of eBay and uh, you can actually buy it in a box, but for some reason I chose to purchase it in this game pack. So I'm assuming it's um, something that is repackaged, but it looks like everything is there. So I thought it'd be fun to kind of Un unpackage this and kind of show you what is in here. I could not find anything about this game. So if you know about this game or have heard of this game, um, let me know in the comments below because I'd love to know more about it. I do know that it came out in 1974. So that's the only fact that I know. So let's get into it. Tear the top off. So here are the pieces. So I'm assuming in the boxed version, everything was just kind of in the box, unless, uh, I mean, unless there's a separate, see, cause like, so this is meant for a bag. So I wonder if they had two different versions of this. So one in a box and one in like a bag form, but I don't know, who knows? Um, so this is the front. Uh, two to four players, ages six to 12. So there's a cute little illustration of Mickey Mouse and Minnie, and then uh, I guess they're two kids or nephews. I'm not sure, I'm not too familiar with the Disney universe. I do know that is Goofy. And then on the back, we have the instructions on how to play. And then next we have this cutout. So this is a wheel. Um, these are cutouts that you can punch out, I guess. And then this is a little spinny thing, which I think goes in here. And then this, I believe, actually there's this too. So these guys. So these are the um, tokens, I guess, if you wanna call it that. So I guess each player would choose a color. And then these are also punch outs. And then this is the board, which is just a piece of, um, it's like a, like a heavy weight paper. I don't know if I, I wouldn't necessarily call it cardstock, but this is the board, which is really cute. And a little, Picture of uh, Mickey Mouse in the in the pizza shop making some pizza, and then serving some pizza, eating. So these are really cute. I really like these cute little drawings or illustrations. All right, and then the back is blank. The object is to be the first Mickey Mouse to reach the finish with three pizzas on his head. So I think that's what these are. So these are probably the things that go onto his head. I'm not sure. Let's, um, let's see what the instructions say. So let's try to assemble one of these pieces. So I'm gonna punch out. Let's do the red one. I like the red one. So I'm gonna punch it out. And then I'm gonna punch out a pizza just to see what that is like. And I'm sure collectors are freaking out. If you're a collector, uh, the fact that I even opened this and I'm like tearing it apart, I'm sure is uh, cringy for some people. But it looks like there's little, there's little perforations here. So I'm assuming that's where it bends and it's totally cracky. So that's, that's fun. I think. Right? Oh, it's. Oh, you have to like bend it, bend it. And then. Do this. So 
is very fascinating right now. Okay, so it's a so it's a triangle. Is that what the? I'm assuming that's what that is. Some kind of triangle. I wish that his face didn't crack. I don't know if it's just because it's so old that it's cracking. And then, um, so the the goal is to collect three of these guys. Um, I'm assuming he punched this out. So there's like a, a boomerang shape here. I'm assuming you punch out so the ears can go through it. Let's see. Is that? Ah, there you go. That's cute. So yeah, so that's, so you have to collect three of these it looks like. And the start is here. And then let's assemble all the little spinny part. It should be pretty simple. There's a little cutout in the middle here. And then you just kind of stick this guy in here. And it does not spin. <laughs> It is not a not a very smooth spin unless I have this. Do I have this one upside down? No, that's how it goes, right? Am I dumb? <laughs> I'm assuming that's how it goes. Let's see. No, it goes on the top. Oh, okay. No, I am I am doing it wrong. Okay, so you have to remove this part. It looks like. So I'm gonna twist that off. And then this goes here, and then this goes under here, right? I'm assuming. Got it. Okay, so it does this thing. It's still not like super spinny. It's very tight, so I'm not sure how you would spin it unless you have to like actually like hold it up and spin it. It's a little looser that way, but if it were like on the table, I don't think that would necessarily work. Anyway, that's a that's a little spinny thing. A five minute explanation of how a how a, how a spinny thing works. <laughs> so yeah, this is definitely a cute game. I would recommend it. I think I paid like 20 bucks for it. So if you can find these, I found mine on eBay. Uh, just type in Mickey Mouse Pizza Party and a couple of them show up. So it's definitely a collector item. <laughs> so I think it's a, it's a fun thing to have in your collection if you're into uh, pizza, pizza stuff or even games. I mean, it's a vintage Mickey Mouse Disney game. So uh, you should check it out. Well, thanks for watching as always. If you haven't already, please remember to subscribe and hit that like button. Also, you can find me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. And until next time, ciao for now.